You probably think this video is about me. It's not. Today, I will talk to you about voting and issue a call to action. I won't tell you who I'm voting for, but if you know me, you can probably figure it out. Many voter registration deadlines have passed by the time you're watching this, so I'm appealing to you, the registered voter who is struggling with choice. There are two points I want to make. One is general and the other specific. I'll start with the general. All of the scandals and the clickbait are definitely worth considering, but more importantly, you have to look at the issues. Determining where candidates stand isn't always the easiest, but if you have a bit of media literacy knowledge, uh, you can find the info that you care about. It is important to figure out what issues are most important to you, and then dig deep until you figure out where your candidate actually stands. The specific thing I have to ask of you is to take a look at the other races being contested. There are many Senate and Congress seats up for grabs this year. For all those of you who complain that government doesn't get anything done, or that Congress or the Senate is just being a roadblock, uh, this is the chance. This, these are the people that legislate. They're the lawmakers. Extending from this, there's a whole host of different positions. You, some counties have elections for dog catcher, for librarians, different councils, committees, uh, and chair positions. There are also uh, often a lot of proposals in different cities and states for uh, zoning laws, tax codes. You may be one of those people who is kind of disgusted at this point with the whole political process. The down ballot elections, that's your chance to make a difference. You may think that that one person in charge of the nation isn't your cup of tea, but there are ways you can make change in your local community, and this is your chance to put your voice forward. I am still registered in the state of New Jersey, even though I'm living in Boston now, but I uh, will be voting by mail. I've got my absentee ballot right here. This is it. There's a lot of stuff on here. Uh, we are all probably familiar with the, the old uh, how to fill in a bubble, but the thing I don't know enough about this election uh, I've been following the presidential race very closely, but in New Jersey, I haven't been really been following the uh, congressional race. So I'll be doing some research tonight. Also on the front is the school board elections. You'll see here in one of these boxes, Marie Desi, my mother. She has proven herself on the school board for the past three years as a champion of both the students and the teachers. Whether you are currently a student, whether you have just gotten out of being a student, or whether you're a parent who has kids in the school system, you know that you, you know what your school has and doesn't have, and the school board are the people that really make that happen. They're the people that relay between the county and state government and the school itself to provide your children or you with what you need to get the best education possible. My mother has brought to bear her experience as a product of the Haddon Township school system, a teacher in a neighboring school district, and as a parent of people who gone to Haddon Township High School. With all of this experience, she's done some really great things. When new sports teams wanted to be added to the roster at the high school, she found a way to not only add it so that the students and parents could be happy and satisfied with their sporting options, she also worked with the board in a way that made use of the available facilities without putting an undue burden on the fields and facilities we already have. As a tireless supporter of the arts, She's also found a way to maintain funding for the visual and performing arts in a time when state and local budgets for these programs have been very low. During her tenure, the board and the town as a whole managed to pass a big budget referendum that has really led to the upgrade and improvement of all of the schools in the district. November 8th, it's my birthday. All I want is the knowledge that you have made an informed decision. Please express your opinion and be actively involved in this nation, in governing this nation, and in making the changes you wish to see. So really, what I most care about is that you've put thought, feelings, some time and effort into actually figuring out who you want to vote for. This is your chance to express your opinion. You don't even have to do it for me. Do it for yourself, because <laughs> you're living here too. I will be getting back to the vlog soon. If you want updates on that, click the subscribe button. If you like this video and would like more, click that thumbs up button. And if you have something to say, and I hope you do, please leave a comment in the comments below.